The 2017 AACR Annual Meeting in Washington, D.C. is a very exciting meeting for us. Mm -hmm. So it's the largest meeting in the world that's devoted to research towards prevention and cures of cancer. The preeminent organization and gathering for anybody who's interested in cancer from all the disciplines as well as our patient advocates. And it's also a forum to present the newest developments in cancer research and for people to um, network around with other cancer researchers around the world. We both very feel strongly that you know we have to focus on prevention and early detection not just on treatment. I think that it's clear that cancer is one of the major problems that we face in human health at the present time. And despite the many advances we're making in cancer therapy, it's clear to me at least that we're not going to be able to treat ourselves out of the cancer problem. So we need to use a multi-pronged approach that embraces prevention, early detection, as well as optimal treatment and survivorship to encompass all of the issues across cancer. Two of the new features we have, one of them we have some new session formats that we introduced. One of them is Unsolved Mysteries, which expresses the kind of dialogue that we want to have between basic science and clinical researchers. It's basically like important problems in cancer research where we have basic scientists and a clinician each present a clinical problem and then how the basic scientist is trying to help address that. So that's one of the new formats. And overall in the meeting, we're trying to have more dialogue and also more involvement of the audience. Another important feature this year is that we've decided to have a presidential select symposium. Mm -hmm. And for this inaugural symposium, we've chosen the topic of cancer disparities. It, it is pretty clear that the burden of cancer is not equal across the population. It's also clear that our insights into how to cope with cancer um, are not widely and equitably distributed. And so one of our goals is to really reflect on the problem of cancer disparities and think about how we can ensure that we have equitable approaches for all individuals who might be at risk for or who would suffer from cancer. One of the challenges young scientists face nowadays is that it's very competitive. Science is very competitive in terms of getting positions, getting funding. The ACR annual meeting, for example, provides the opportunity to meet other scientists at the same level or at more senior level. We have many mentoring sessions during an ACR meetings where more senior successful scientists actually tell their story and give an example to these trainees that yes, you can make it. It's not always an easy straight line to succeed, but there is an opportunity there and it's a great career choice if they pursue that. One of the most exciting areas in current cancer research is of course immunotherapy and immunology. Combination immunotherapies, predictors of response to immunotherapy, resistance to immunotherapy. This will be one of the topics that it's very well covered by multiple sessions at the meeting. Combination therapies and monitoring evolution of the cancer, new technologies, CRISPR, application of CRISPR, single cell profiling, liquid biopsies to monitor the tumor evolution. These are all areas that will be, you know, um, new, many new developments and will be well represented at the meeting. I think we're also going to hear a lot about the work on tumor heterogeneity mm -hmm. and what that means ultimately in terms of our ability to deliver therapies and to be able to detect cancer and its molecular alterations more uh, precisely for individual patients. We also hope that we're going to be able to hear some of the latest work that has to do with things like prevention, with implementation science, with some of the focus on the areas that were identified by the Blue Ribbon Committee over the course of the last year as they thought about the most important challenges that we could confront in cancer over the near term. <laughs>